you haven't started creating content yet. You still haven't earned any money from the internet. You still don't have a monetizable channel. You haven't utilized AI to make money yet. We're just kidding. I'm just kidding. So guys, in this video, I'll teach you how to create viral videos discussing historical eras of country occupations. We'll use tools like Animaker for creating talking animations, Papper Animator to add paper effects to images, Eleven Labs AI, Leonardo AI, and Pixabay. As usual, we'll use CapCut for editing. So let's dive in and start creating our short video. Before that, let's get a quick overview of what we'll be creating today. In the 19th century, French soldiers occupied many countries, including Algeria, Vietnam, and parts of West Africa. Tens of thousands of soldiers were deployed to establish and maintain colonial rule, expanding France's influence and control over resources and territories. This period of occupation left a lasting cultural and political impact on these regions. Today, under the leadership of President Emmanuel Macron, France continues to address its complex colonial legacy, striving to build better relationships with its former colonies. First, we go to ChatGPT. After that, we copy the first prompt, but before doing so, add the name of the country you want to talk about. For example, I will talk about France in the 19th century, so I will add that as you can see. After this, we copy it and send it to ChatGPT to create a short 45-second script for us. As you can see, it writes the script, but we will ask it to rewrite it in one paragraph. Like that, we now have a good script for our idea. Next, we will need photos and videos, so we copy the second prompt to ask GPT to write prompts for creating images using AI. Like that, as you can see, it writes prompts we can use. If you read the script, you will see it mentions Algeria, Vietnam, and the rest of Africa, as well as the image of the President of France. So we will go to Google and download the flag of each country. Just check the copyright of the image before using it. After downloading the images, we go to Leonardo AI to create images. First, we check the number of images, the styles, and the shape of the images. Then we copy each prompt from ChatGPT paste it into Leonardo, and click to generate. Wait a little, and the images will appear. We repeat this method for all prompts. After finishing the images, we download the best ones. Then, we go directly to Runway to transform these images into videos. Click on the tool, and this interface will appear. Now, upload every image you need to transform into a video like this, and click Generate. While waiting for the video to appear, upload the next image simultaneously to save time. After the results appear, click the download button above each video to download it. Next, go to the site. You will find all the sites in the description of this video. This video has no collaborations. In the first step, change the background to green. Then, choose your character. We will choose a police character because we are talking about occupation and war. After selecting the character, add the movement you need. There are many moves to choose from. Select one and click export. Wait for the upload to finish and then click download to download the video. Now go to the site called Paper Animated. Here, upload your image that needs a paper effect. Before that, change the background to a green color background. After that, add the image you want like this and click this button to add the animation. If you need to add a glow or edit the animation, you can do so using the buttons on the right. I will apply this effect to the images we need, such as the Algerian and Vietnamese flags, as well as Macron's image and some images generated by Leonardo AI. Now, 
After finishing with the images, use the same method for the text. Add your text by clicking here, and you can edit the style and font size. Now we go to YouTube and download videos of the map of Africa, ensuring they are free of copyright, as well as the flag of France and an old paper background. Also download videos with effects like cinematic, old video, and transition overlay camera. All the links to these videos can be found in my community telegram link in the description. Join us. Next we go to ChatGPT and copy the paragraph. Then we go to Eleven Labs AI to turn the script into vocal audio. Choose a voice, paste the script here, click the generate button, and download your vocal as you can see. Now we go to a site to remove the background from an image we will need at the beginning of the video. Upload it like this, wait a little, and download it by the end. Next, go to the Pixabay site to download the song we will use as background music for this video. Search for it and download it, checking the copyright rules before use. Now, it's editing time. We go to the CapCut application and add all the supplies we downloaded earlier. The first step is to add a video we generated before as the background. As you can see, we add some effects to this video. First, blur, adjusting its opacity. Then the vignette effect, also adjusting its opacity. Next, we add the edge glow effect, reducing its opacity a little, followed by the ripple effect, adjusting its settings by reducing it. And finally, we add the leak to effect, also reducing its opacity. After this, we add the person and move them to the left side, as you can see. Then, we add the slide app animation, add a keyframe, and move the person to the left again, as shown. Next, we add the video of the flag above the background video. Just watch with me and you will understand all the steps. After adding it, go to the mask option, add the feather option, and change the place of the flag across the entire video. Finally, add a simple fade-in animation to the flag. After this, we add the audio of the script. Then, we copy the background video and paste it again to extend the duration. We then remove its animation. Next, we add the old paper background video, adjust its duration, and reduce its volume. We position it correctly and apply a Zoom 2 animation. Now we add the video of the character. First, we cut out the watermark and remove the background. We position the character in the left corner and add a slide left animation. Next, we animate the flags. We start with the Algerian flag, remove its green background and position it. We use the same method for the Vietnamese flag. We adjust their timing and add animations. For the text, we include the names of the countries, adjust the style and font, and add an in animation. We then add the next video, zoom it to a 916 format, and apply the necessary animation. Following this, we add the videos generated by Runway, applying an in animation to each. We cut them to size and add them one by one, ensuring they relate to the events described in the script. When we reach the last image, we add it using the same method. We cut a part of the video, add effects like blur, vignette, and leak too, and adjust their opacity. Finally, we insert the video containing the image of the President of France, remove the green background, and position it. We also add the second video with Macron President, adjusting its placement accordingly.
Now we add an image and apply a combo animation to it. Next, we incorporate the last two videos, remove their backgrounds, and adjust their placements for a cohesive view. We then add the effect videos we downloaded earlier, adjusting their placement and opacity by choosing the Screen Blend option. Afterward, we return to each video and apply the combo animation. We also add a shake animation to the police image and adjust its opacity. Next, we add the text, France, adjusting its position as needed. We then change the colors of the characters, two in red, the next two in white, and the last two in blue, positioning the text to the right. An animation is added, and its opacity is slightly reduced. Moving on, we use the Effects feature to add vignette effects to all videos and images. We then add camera transition videos, cutting and pasting them where transitions are needed. For sound effects, we search for whoosh and add it to each instance of slide animation such as at the beginning of the video. We also search for open paper sound effects and add them where paper opening effects occur. Next, we choose auto captions, select the English language, and click create. Once the captions appear, we adjust their template, fonts, and position them in the middle of the screen. Finally, we add background music, reduce its volume slightly, and apply fade in and fade out effects. After completing these steps, we export the short video, ensuring to check the quality and frame rate before finalizing. See you in the next video. Bye.